السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته و still flying over Europe going to the east crossing Bosnia to Bulgaria and why I'm going to Africa today why Africa again unfortunately we ignored Africa many times years and years and years ago but being preoccupied by wars or war on terror conflicts disasters ethnic cleansing in Rohingya in Yugor and the war in Yemen Syria and the internal conflict in uh, Iraq the divide which has been made to us by other communities or other people to divide us and to distract us and keep us away from Africa. I've been extremely busy, busy with all the problems affecting humanity, whether it's in the Far East, as far as you go in China, in Turkestan, or as far as Rohingya, in Myanmar, Bangladesh, as far as the war, the unjust war in Yemen, the unjust war in Syria, and all these, the floods, the earthquake, the tsunami, we forgot Africa. Africa which has the kindest people on earth, most generous, most loving nations. But actually, we don't care for them anymore. That's why I have to shift my strategy again, as we started more than 35 years ago, by the wake-up call of Bosnia, but the family in Africa in 1983. Wake-up call of Bosnia, when I visited Bosnia in 1982 to discover what was happening, what has been happening at that time. Then, the famine in Africa in 1983 in Eritrea and Tigray. We have to go back to Africa. Africa, the rich country, the rich continent, the rich people, the kind people, the generous people, the hospitable people. Africa has been stolen by all these big rich companies who are coming to make corruption as a system and let everybody in the, in, the, in the continent to follow the system of corruption. Without corruption, such multinational companies will never thrive. Such multinational companies will never exist. Such multi number, multinational companies will never support their countries who are protecting them. This is where you, young men and young women, have to go now. Have to go now, have to go now to Africa again. To Africa again, to Africa again. To teach, educate, support, to advocate, to raise awareness for the people of Africa. To guide people, to build the community, to stand up for them and let them to stand up for humanity. This is what we want, you and me and the others, to go to Africa again, 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 again. Can you join hands with us to go to this piece of land, which is a gift from God to us? It has gone stop. The ethnic cleansing of Central African Republic, what's happening in the Democratic Republic of Congo, what's happening by the terrorist and radical group in different parts of Nigeria and Somalia, as well as others, and to stop the people who are supplying these terrorist groups with arms and money and bring solution, not talk about the problem. I would love 
to put my hand in your hands and go to Africa and you lead and I follow you or you lead and we follow you and you become the change maker and we help you. We're not going to forget Africa as we did in the past. We're going to remember Africa and Africa forever in our hearts. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.